Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how I made this miniature kitchen. I hope you'll enjoy this tutorial. If you do, feel free to like, share and subscribe. And if you don't want to miss my next video, you can activate the notification bell. I started by preparing the walls using cardboard, paperboard, paint and paper clips. If you're interested in the measurements, you can find them at the end of this video. But please keep in mind that depending on the thickness of your cardboard, you might have to use different measurements. Usually I apply a layer of fast and clear trying varnish before painting in order to avoid the walls from bending. I forgot to do that unfortunately, but lucky for me it's hardly noticeable. And for those of you who are interested in the materials that I use for this project, there's a list in the description box. Here you can see me using contact paper or sticky back plastic and paperboard to make miniature tiles. To make the part of the kitchen with working cabinets, I'm using paperboard and cardboard. Now I'm drawing the layout of the kitchen and when cutting out the pieces for the shelves, beware that some of them are 5 cm wide and some only 4 because the cabinet doors need enough space to rotate. Now glue everything together using hot glue. You might be wondering why there is a sink now and why I'm removing it later on. That's because I forgot that I put a sink in the kitchen island and I didn't want to have a second one. Now I'm using self-adhesive cork to make miniature bricks for the backsplash. Because I don't want the edges to be visible, I'm hiding them by gluing strips of paperboard on top. And in addition to that, you'll need clear plastic, foam board and paint to create the inside of the fridge and the oven.
And as you can see, once again, I made a little mistake and forgot to cut a small gap into the shelf so that the oven door has enough space to be opened and shut. So I'm cutting out a little square on the door instead. And now I'm using a thick piece of wire to make the handle.